Editors note, this list will be updated as new information comes into the newsroom. Two charter schools will remain closed Tuesday May 8th. KUAO Kala New Century Public Charter School will be closed Tuesday and Wednesday, and aims to open on Thursday. Grades 4 to 12 will be located at the Boys and Girls Club in Hilo, and school officials are still in search of a new place for the K-3 students. The Hawaii Academy of Arts and Science Public Charter School will be closed Tuesday. Kaumek AQ will be open Tuesday except for its pre-K class. Students on the Pohoaka campus will be relocated to other sites. Please visit the school's website for additional information. All public schools on Hawaii Island as well as school bus transportation are operating on normal schedules. Hawaii State Department of Education structural engineers performed site inspections at all public schools in the Hilo Waiakea and Kaukea Alpehoa complex areas over the weekend and found no significant structural damage from recent earthquake activity. Air quality will be monitored at area schools. Should air quality drop, schools are prepared to shelter in place in designated locations. Earthquake activity has prompted the State Department of Land and Natural Resources Division of State Parks to close its Lava Tree State Monument and Mackenzie State Recreation Area until further notice. Gates to these parks will be locked and closure signs posted. U.S. Postal Service impacts the Hilo Downtown Post Office reopened for business Monday, May 7. The postal facility, located in the Hilo Federal Building at 154 Wainuanue Avenue, was closed on Friday, May 4, when the Federal Building was evacuated due to structural concerns in the wake of the earthquakes that have accompanied the eruption. USPS reminds residents of the evacuated areas of Pehoa, Puna that they should pick up their mail at the Pehoa Post Office at 15-2859 Pehoa Village Road while their neighborhoods are inaccessible. USPS also advises that all residents who have evacuated in response to the eruption, whether from the officially evacuated neighborhoods or other nearby areas, submit change of address forms so that their mail can be redirected to them in a timely manner. Click here for more